Rabbit Productions here with another LEGO Minecraft review. Today I have two of the Europe exclusive magazine promo sets. The first one is 662304, the Ninja Zombie and TNT Launcher with 21 pieces. And we have over here 662305, the Nether Hero and Enderman set, which comes with 19 pieces and two minifigures. So without further ado, let's take a look at these sets. Here we have the first set, and as the set name implies, it comes with a zombie, a ninja, and a TNT launcher, which is honestly kind of a cool little thing. Of course, we got a TNT launcher with a skeleton one, which I believe was the second or like third of these little promos to be released. So first we have a zombie, very basic, but you know, nice to get. Uh, it gives you an enemy to fight against. And of course we have a ninja, which came in the, I think the ninja, I can't remember the set name, but there's a ninja set released. I think it's like, it has like a cherry blossom tree and some of the lush caves underneath. I did a review of it, so I'll link a, the video to here. But this minifigure is no longer exclusive, but that's okay with me. It's a cool minifigure to get, and I really like the printing actually, so that's very nice. And of course you have the netherite sword and an apple, which is nice. And of course we have the TNT launcher, which is very basic, uh, very few pieces used, which is nice, but it comes with a little TNT. And you know, you can set up the zombie, and if you push this, the TNT launches, and boom, I blew up the zombie, how awesome. So yeah, it's, it's very basic, but it's a fun little thing to play with, and it actually has an action feature built into it, which is, in my opinion, pretty cool. For the next set, we get a nether hero and an enderman. It's nice to get an enderman because we don't actually get a lot of endermen nowadays. I feel like the last one we got was in that nether, or end set of the end battle. But after that, I think like we haven't gotten one in a long time. So it's it's good to get more endermen because these are really awesome figures. And also in such like a, a cheap set. And it also comes with a little plate so it can stand, which is nice. So now you can have the enderman sitting and it also has a stone block in its hands. And then, of course, we have the Nether Hero, which the reason why this is the Nether Hero, because it came in the Nether Bastion set. And so, yeah, this is a cool figure to get again. Um, and yeah, it's got a gold sword, and I really like the printing on it. But other than that, this one's kind of basic with just two minifigures. And so, yeah, now let's take a look at the packaging and then my final verdict. Here are the packaging. They use the paper bags now for these, which is very interesting. And um, there's no instructions. Of course, you can kind of build them based off of the pieces that you see it's not very hard to do and they don't give you any extra so you got to use all the pieces you know and so it's kind of these ones were really easy to build so yeah that's really that's really all i have to say about the packaging now let's take a look at my final verdict For my final verdict both of these are very good sets i personally like this one more as it has more to do with an action feature and you know an enemy and um, a good mini figure here where this one is just it's nice to get an enderman and a cool figure again however it's just that and there's no like terrain or anything so yeah overall i like this one a lot this one's good for what it is and it's putting out more characters so that's good but yeah that's really all i have to say about these if you like this video please consider liking and subscribing and i'd like to see you guys in my next video peace out bye